All right, so we're starting a new channel and we are thinking of these names and David's name is gonna be Della. Della Compa Hey Hey. Huh? <laughs> Della Compa Della Compa Hefa Hey Hey. Oh, Della Compa Hefa Hey Hey. Della Compa Hefa Hey Hey. And we have Desta. Desta Nel uh Desta Hone ha ha Desta Hone ha ha <laughs> Desta Hone ha ha Desta Desta Oh Desta Libra he Desta Libra Hone he he ha ha he he Yours is he he mine's ha ha Right or yours is ha ha mine's he he Mine's he he De la compra He he No de la compra hefa he he Della Compra have a hey hey. Mine's Desta Libra Horne ha ha. <laughs> Desta Horne, no, Desta Libra Horne ha ha. <laughs> and you can call me Desti Horne or ha ha. <laughs> it's funnier earlier, man. Desta Horne ha ha ha. It's too long, man. It's too long. Too long. What is it? What is it? <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> we got a new pet. Remember what we're gonna do with yeah. that?
at it back here. I need to make some noises because he's pulling so I know it's painful. I'll switch it up and go to the front a minute. Legs are really, really matted. If the body doesn't get as matted as the legs, I want to see him at least maintain the legs. Don't let him get this matted again. Because it's painful, so it makes it even harder on an aggressive dog to work with matted areas. To see that as soon as I started messing with the matted areas, he starts moving around. Which he's saying, get off, it hurts, leave me alone, stop that. Over here. This is going to be tough. Come on, buddy, you got this, man. You got this. Good boy, you got this. You got this, baby. Come on, baby boy. Look at all those masks coming off. You can get your tools at myfavoritegrower.com. This is the Andis 5B with a 10 blade. You should have two or three or 13. I have 13 10 blades I can cycle through. So that when they get hot, which I may or may not, you may or may not see, depending on how long the video is, Make sure you have enough tin blades to do the job. Cool it and oil in between, which is not the same day, but in the evening to oil up your blades and keep them in good condition so they'll last quite a few years. I mean, like over 10 years. Let's change out our blade. We're moving fast because he's very mean and we need to utilize the walk that he went on so that I can get done before he's not tired anymore. So I'm going, I'm actually going very fast to finish the body fast because we're going to spend probably 40 minutes on the face if I can do the face at all. And uh, due to his age, depending on how long this takes, we may or may not book the face the second day depending on how stressed out he is. You don't take grandma on a 90 mile run and expect her to be okay if she hasn't run every day for a while getting ready for that run, okay? So... We just have to see how he feels, what he looks like, what he's acting like, and how long and how long it's been for me to go ahead and get all the mats off that he has now. Hold on, buddy. Hold on. Are you okay up here? You're okay. You're okay, buddy. Back side. Right there. Right there. Is that itchy right there? See the snow real quick. Take the snow off. Completely matted. Hup, 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 hup. Right there. There's your tail. There's your tail. Let's get in in about two to... And I want to say that, but we'll talk about how often he should come in. Aggressive dogs I don't really want to see as often, but I don't want them matted again after I've gotten it off. So if it starts getting matted, do an a la carte. Come in before the matting starts. Hey, Dee Dee, I just want you to do the feet. Hey, Dee Dee, just do a nail trim and shave the legs. Hey, Dee Dee, just shave his face um, before it gets matted. If it gets matted, then it's just hard every time for everybody. We just took this big, huge thing off right here, and it's right there. That's the underside of this back leg. Oh, oh, oh. Where are you going, buddy? Where are you going? Don't go anywhere just yet. Okay, don't go anywhere just yet.
I'm gonna come back really short there because it's all matted, so I'll just come back. three times all right Change my blade three times. I'm using a 10 blade. It's the shortest, safest blade. You need to get under the matting when you're shaving mats off. You can't go through them. You need to go under them. So you can see the 10 blade is the shortest, safest way to go for this guy. So right here, I'm already cut a hole. Right there's my hole with my finger. Look, it's going straight through. I know that there's no skin there. I'm going to cut this opening so I can have spread it out like I'm like I'm cutting chicken in like a butterfly and, and I'm sauteing some chicken so I can spread it out and open it up like this. He can easily right now he's loose enough to whip up and bite my neck and I'm very aware of that so I'm watching all everything. If you didn't catch how he was acting in the lobby, switch over to that and look at it. He was acting very mean in the lobby. So his capabilities are, are there. I'm going to do a pull forward, but also stick, kind of go back and forth here. Up, 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 up. I'm pulling, but I'm also loosening the neck. I'm actually pulling his arm forward. But making sure his neck is good. It's not like I'm neglectful. I'm watching everything he's doing. His breathing, his panting, his pulling, his jerking. This is one arm. This is a whole arm here, okay? Let's not do that. Let's get to... I'm not saying like that. I'm sure that there's a reason. There is a reason with the client. I know that. I know the reason, what I mean is. But let's. now that she's found someone that will help her, let's stay preventative. That means let's not let it get that way ever again. Well, he's pulling too, man. He's giving me a workout. He's pulling back every time I pull his arm forward. He's pulling back, like, get off of me. Right there, you can see him flinch right there. So he's like, no, no, <laughs> no, you can't have it, he said. Look, he knows what he's doing. He knows he doesn't want me to touch him. He's like, no, you can't have it. Well, 
we still got to do that other arm and all the feet and all the pads. I'm going to change my 10 blade. On to the fourth 10 blade in like probably what, maybe 20, 30 minutes. I don't know what I need a clock up in here. I'm going really fast. I'm moving really fast and so is my blade. started moving, he was going to twist, I don't know what he's going to do, but I changed the subject with my loud voice. Up. Good boy, let me take a look at what's going on down here. Good boy, let me see down here, don't get mad at me now, got some mess in here I want to see. Stay there, good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, let me get it, good boy, look how mad it is in there, pulling at his groin and everything, no, no sir, no sir. No, sir. No, sir. You're good. You're good. I'm going to get it all out. Good boy. Good boy. Hang tight. Okay, hold on. Can I do that one more time? There you go. Good boy. One here up on the chest. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Down, good boy. Watch that. Thank you. Good boy. Good boy. Let me check this side. All right, let's do this side, Mama. This arm here. I'm gonna, I say that when we come out here real quick. Side of the arm, bro. That you cannot brush that out on an aggressive dog. You have it, buddy. You see the un armpit, okay? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Check my knee. Okay, we're all right for a minute. I'm sweating. All right, let's do the pads now. Ooh, where are you going? Ooh, where are you going to go? Where are you going? Are you watching? No. Are you mesmerized watching? <laughs> This back in the day? Where was he gonna go? Whew. Okay, 40 blade. We're gonna do the pad, so everything's gonna be this direction. Everything's gonna be this direction. Oh, you're wagging your tail. Fast wag means I wanna bite you. So I'm watching everything on that. Make sure the front looks good too. You can move that, you know. You know what I mean, up there?
draw the line. Doing the outro. Here we go, the nail trip. It's really important for me not to hit the vein here, even if I don't get the nail trim all the way down. I need him to know that I'm not going to hurt him and I'm not going to let him down. That's why he's acting this way. If someone was hitting the nail vein a lot. Are you okay? Okay. Okay, alright. That battery is about to go out, and if the I have that one ready over there, and then put that on. It's in my office. Put it back on the charger. Put that one on the charger when it does go out. Oh, I was still needed a forty blade. What am I doing? Would you eat a treat right now? Would you eat a treat? Is it possible? Would you eat a treat? Would you eat a treat? No? You wouldn't eat it? Everybody always thinks I should give you guys treats. Would you eat a treat? Would you even eat it right now? Would you even eat it? Hmm? Would you even eat it? No, he wouldn't. He wouldn't even eat that right now. Shh. See, my hands are really dirty, and messing with food is not idealistic for me during a grooming, but I still tried to do it for the client because she brought me a bunch of treats. I'm using the Andis 5 speed and the 40 blade. I would love it if you purchased from me at myfavoritegroomer.com. If you need training, please contact me and come out and get some toenail training and pad shaving training. Give it to me. Give it to me. I got you, man. Stand up. Put your head up. Put your head up. Okay. Okay. Okay, I'll do it this other way. Are you going to poop on me? Are you going to poop? I can smell it. Let me see. No, 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 no. Hold on, please. Hold on. You got this. Lift your head up. Lift your head up, honey. You're okay? You're a goof. You're being goofy right now. Yes. So I come over here, you're okay. You're tricking me? Don't trick me. I'm trying to help you, you know? Okay? All right. I'm going to start back on that last foot, okay? Let me try again. Let me see. Let me see it. Let me see it. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Look, everybody knows your pain right now. All the dogs know your pain right now.
right, so matted, so matted. Never again, okay, mom, never again. Pads are extremely matted. Never, 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 never again. Never again. You cannot be this matted ever, ever, ever again. Now that you know me, we cannot get this matted ever again. You hear him screaming. Okay, ready? Let me see. We're almost done with it, honey. We're almost done. <laughs> Everybody knows you're upset. Everyone knows it's painful, okay? Everybody back here can hear you. And they feel sorry for you right now. Front, you know what I'm saying? We're almost done with it, okay? We are almost done with it. <laughs> That's gonna break. I ordered it for something. I don't know about you, but I'm sweating. Is anybody else sweating? So the pad on top, the feet on top are matted. So now I've done the pads on the bottom and I still need to do the front toenail trim, but I'm going to come do the pads, excuse me, the feet on top and then come do the toenail trim. I got my template, I'm just doing what we would do on poodles, which is clean feet, because they're so matted in here. We've got debris in there and stuff. When you're taking the hair down, down like this, and then back up, it's not gonna be even, and that's okay. In matted cases, it's just, that's not what we're here for. We're here for hygiene cut. We're not here to be perfect. When you start doing back and forth and all that, unless you go backwards around the whole body, it's not gonna look exactly even, but it might be hard to tell anyway because there's so many spots that were matted. Hold on to the camera with your right hand. With your left hand, unscrew this, close that. You know what I mean? Hold on to the camera. Yep, yep, exactly. Hup, hup. Hold on, hold on. I know there's a, there's a bunch of stuff going on in there. Let me see, don't get mad. Ah, let me look. 
Let me get it all, okay? You're gonna have to bear with me here. Spread your toes. Okay, hold on. Spread your toes for me. Spread your toes. Let me get in there. I don't know what that is. He ain't having it. Really? I'm gonna take it no matter what, bro. What is that? Okay, good job. Good job, buddy. Good job, okay? I'm proud of you. So proud of you. All right, let me go over here and do this one. We're almost done with your body. I should clarify. With your body, we're almost done. Senior dogs that are tired, but that when they get on the table, man, they gotta fight, and I don't think it at all no more. I'm like, they could run a mile if they wanted to, you know. I'm not saying it's good for them, but they're running a mile on my table. Try something different, 
buddy. Try something different here, buddy. I got you. I got you. You can get all your toenail clippers at myfavoritegroomer.com. is going to be your face. Okay, let's do a regroup real quick. Okay, do a regroup. I'm going to take just a second to myself. But pet parent, mom, can you come back here a second? Oh, you can, you can. do this but come just give him some loving okay just come here and just give him you don't have to kiss him and all that but put your hand on his body tell him you love him because yeah. you do right you love him yeah. give him some loving okay don't let him fall off the table just give him some get up close like you love him give me those give me those okay these are going to be right here for a second just give me give him some loving real quick let me just stand here a second i'm so hot how are we doing uh, it's incredible. Uh, you know, I'm so sorry he's so mad at but I mean, I have been trying to, you know, I had surgery in October with a hip replacement last October. 2022 or 21? No, 22. 22. October 2022 you had surgery. Yeah. And so, and I came out of surgery with a foot drop, so I had to wear a brace. And, um, so it's been, I have tried and tried to find somebody that would learn him. Right. And nobody would. And so we just kept looking and looking. And we've tried to do it. My granddaughter's tried to do it. She didn't even hold him out there in the lobby. There we no tried way. to do it. We put a, tried to put a thing around him when they were here after school was out. Right after school right. was out in the summer. 2023? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this this year mm -hmm. when they they came home, they teach school in Dallas. Okay. And when they came home, they tried to help help me do some, and we did we did get a little bit done. Right on the body then, or the legs? Yeah, on the body, not the legs. Yeah. Yeah. Now he'll he'll let me do the back legs, touch the back legs more than. Um, but boy, you start messing these front legs, and he will tear you oh, up. And I why is that? The front compliance? Someone that especially that that arm, that one arm, that they've been hitting the nail vein on those. Over and over and over. Were you going somewhere for a while? Like well, did you so stay at one groomer for three to five years? That's my oh yeah. From here. One from specific groomer for three, five, or seven years is gonna be where when I see your dogs. Three years they'll call me, five years, seven and nine. Yeah. Well, uh, she he went to her from let's see, we got him in twenty eleven. So he started going to her in twenty eleven and went to her instead and in, in, at least until twenty nineteen. That's eight years. Or twenty. Yeah. So eight or nine years. Because that was in Avalon and I was dropping right. back to take him because you know because And I think you might have told me on the phone he was happy. Was well, that you I was talking about? Yeah, well, remember I told you that? You, well, you said he was happy every time you picked him up. And I, I said, that's right. I said, think about him ha so happy to get the heck out of there. He's seeing you. Yeah. You, you could now see it that way, right? And I know she kept him. I would take him and leave him. So I, I, she said, well, we'll have him here by 8.30. You know, so I take him. But sometimes I didn't get to pick him up until 2.30 or 3. And she put him in a kennel. And I know he would bark and bark and bark and bark and bark. So see, I don't really know what time right. she did him. Right. You know. And right. So and you don't know what happened actually. So you're asking me. My no, professional okay. opinion is that somebody who had him more than once, off more than ten times, even more than two times, 
Someone who saw him often hit that vein on that right foot a lot. That's his, um, where he screams. He doesn't, he doesn't like me doing any of the feet. He doesn't like me doing the other front foot. But he screams on that one. He screamed twice. Yeah, he and for a long period of time. He said surgery. On that one. So right. maybe that one has also has no, arthritis. Not on this one. Oh, well, see then. Is that where they put the needle? To yeah, put but that's the not, nah, 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 not like this. Not like this. Because they sedated it when they cleaned no, his teeth. That's, this is something, prolonged pain. Prolonged injuries. Like, oh, like you coming in and I constantly nick your foot every time I do your pedicure. I cut your foot, you go home, you band-aid it. Now, the 10th time or maybe the 15th, you're going to go, don't, don't be careful with that. Because I'm doing that with one of my feet. They did something, something. So what I'm saying is just over and over, now it's just PTSD. But now it was so bad that they, this is what he acts like. It's, it's like, ah! Yeah. Right? Well, I'm embarrassed that he's so mad at you know, and well, I'm not uh, holding you accountable like that, but what I am showing you is let's never oh, be I'm here good. again. That's why I keep saying that. I'm not saying you're an asshole. I'm not saying you're a bad parent. I'm not saying none of those things. What I am saying out of my mouth is don't come back ever. Now that you have found me, yeah. I never. I would rather you say in a month, Dee Dee just, I can't afford it, but can you do it for 30 bucks? Just shave his pads. I, I just want you to do something. So that we can never be back there again. Because yeah. you did find somebody without sedation to work with him. Yeah. Even if I don't even get his, I, I'm gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do something with his face. But even if I don't even touch his face, you have to do his nails and his pads with me. And I don't want anyone else touching his nails if that's gonna make him bleed. Which means if you go somewhere, you need to look at them. If they're making them bleed, you're just putting us one step forward, two steps back. Do you understand why? I sure do. Okay. Because I can't get better with him, even if, if I can at his age. I don't know that I can make stride with him if someone else is still causing injury okay. or pain. I have him rude all the time. I mean, we, it was a regular yeah. deal. And he, right. He went like every few weeks, you know, to the group. This poor guy. Yeah. But He's been through something. That long? I mean, a lot. Like that many years. If I just did something today, one time, he ain't going to bother him like that. He ain't going to go home and remember it for 10 years. Yeah. But if I did something to him every time you came in, then he's going to get, he's going to gain to be a problem and then not let me touch him anymore. Mm -hmm. You know? All right. I don't know how you're going to do this first. Well, let's go out there and pray for me. Okay? I'm just <laughs> go out there and pray for me and then I'm going to let you go now. So I want to give him just a chance to feel love from you. That he's safe, he's good, and then we're gonna go into the face right now, okay? okay? And I'm sweating bricks. I don't know if anybody else is. Are you? Why am I sweating bricks? I never sweat this much, and I got the AC down to 69 right now. I'm literally sweating. You can't see a thing. Can you see the sweat right here? Just don't even say yes. Okay. All right, Mama. Can you uh, take that call? Can you put your hand right there and unbuckle the collar like you were just there for a second? Can you do that? I'm doing that. I need that collar off, not the leash, the collar. Yep. Oh. Yep. Sorry. I said collar. Can you can you do it? Okay. Hey, hey. I don't know where it is. Yeah. See. Okay. Then never mind. But it won't be perfect around his neck because I can't get that collar off. But I'll try. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. So I'm next sorry, time, listen. Out. Next time, you're gonna. Uh, I'm gonna send you home with the lead. When you leave your house, you use that lead. Because that's what I need. I don't need all this stuff in my way. On an aggressive job for me trying to get this off is stupid. Okay? Because okay? you saw how he was acting. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and go in the lobby, Mom. Okay. Am I doing okay? You're doing great. You're doing great. Thank you. All that drill sergeant yelling and all that was, was okay? Oh, yeah. I, I saw a <laughs> thing on TV one time where they were grooming a dog and he... Uh, Every time they'd touch his nails, he'd yell like that, you know. But he was just doing it. He was just oh. being honorary. And I don't know if it's really hurting him or if he's just being honorary. <laughs> okay. Okay. Be careful. I'll see you on the screen. Did I get you excited by bringing your mom in here? Mm -hmm. You're excited now? Okay, hold on. And were you going to try to bite me right there?
can just leave it staying for a second. Um, you can just leave these sitting for a second until I really get into the face. Let me just clean up the neck. But the, the, I mean, this is still capturing, so it's fine. You know what I'm saying? Like any sudden movements is still capturing. But let me get save your footage and all that for the face. And I want to say, um, if you can listen to me, outside under the TV, the gray stand, under the gray stand is a plastic bin, and inside that is your black smock. You can go get it. Yeah, underneath is a bin. And inside that with the fabric might be your black smock. I can't remember if I left it in that one or what. You can go get it, you'll need it. Please. If not, I have one in here, the silk one you can wear. Now you can see me. Okay. This is that one. Okay. All of it under there? It's okay. Am I gonna hold or something? Maybe on the lay, lay flat the you, flat you face. Have an apron? Oh, right here, check this area for me. 
I mean, I have something, but I wanted you to see that I had yours still. I just had Betty trying to fix it, but she never did get to it. Is this off now? Yeah, it turns off for a minute. Okay, here we go. Let me see. Um, what do I want to do here? I put this on for a reason. I put this on for a backup, but I really need to... Okay, hmm. Hmm. I just gotta think how how I want to do it so I don't lose my position. Yeah, I have to do this. Okay, we're gonna put this one on. Okay. have your aggressive dogs, the best thing you can do is not bring them in with a leash and collar unless you can take it off yourself. So it took me all that time to just get the collar off. Watch out. I'm still okay. So just, uh, this is not for you, it's for the camera. So now I'm going to pull an ear back here. And because I'm using two cone heads, it's because he's pretty mean with his face. And I'm assuming he's going to whip it and throw one off. That's exactly like that, okay? And he's probably going to whip this one off too. So um, he, it was really hard to put it on. So what I want to do is actually put this one over here, but I still want his ear out. This is my little trick to work on part of his face before I like really lose everything, all the stuff to really get the hair off. So let's just try this for a minute and see if he'll let me shave his ear here. You can get your cone heads on myfairgroomer.com. I have a listing that you can get two of the same size. So if you're doing exactly what I'm doing, two mediums, two smalls. So you can at least get the ears and the back of the head done when it's really hard to do an aggressive dog's face. The light just turned on. This ear is bad. get bit if you're if you if you don't watch what you're doing I'm gonna you're gonna put me in position to get bit. Cameras have zoom. And I haven't been bit in 20 years so 17 years. Okay right here I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out. This one you can do overhead. Look at this. Do you remember this? Look at this ear, Mom. Can you see it? That big chunk of hair right there? This, this hair has to be pulled out regularly. Here we go. Wait. Go. You're good. You're good. You're good. You're very, very good. You're very, very good, okay? We're going to do a little bit at a time here. A little bit at a time. Good boy. Good boy. Look at all that. Look at all that in his ear. This has to be pulled out. You guys want to leave it in there? No. That's not what you do. You never leave that in there. 
Good boy. Let me see it now. Let me see it now. Good boy. How are you going to let me do that but you're going to attack me when I come to your face? You're something else. You're something else, bro. Okay. Good to go on that for a second. Look at all that. Look at all that, Mom. 